What up y'all, this is Cruz. Coming to y'all today with another video about pomades and, and moisturizers, what you should use for your hair. Now I'm gonna start off with the pomades. Thick, I'm gonna go from light or medium to plain thick. Well, I really don't have a thick pomade, but this one I'm gonna just go off of what I have. Now, Wolf and Pomade, Cold Label. Get that off, well, I don't know the site exactly. I think it's coldlabel.co, but um, it's thick. It's kind of thick. I would say medium. It's not Murray's type thick, but it's, it's thick. Now, what should you use this for? When should you use it? You should use it when your hair is thick, obviously. When your hair is medium to real thick. And when I say thick, I mean by where it's almost to a point where you can't manage it without putting products in. So that's the type of thick I mean. So Wolf and Pomade, how would I describe it? It's good, it got a nice smell to it. It's decent. I use it from time to time, but now this is my tip. Don't put a product, don't put any pomades in your head before you go to sleep at night because I find that it, it makes your hair hard in the morning because it's, it's jam packed, it's, it's packing your head down for so long and I believe it's, it crunches your curls up and it, it puts it out of place. It, it ruins your connections, I would say. I would say it throws it off overnight and it, it crunches your curls up like I said at first. So. I would suggest putting a moisturizer in at night. Put a pomade in during the day or before night, but always put the moisturizer in your hair overnight. You don't have to worry about the moisturizer. Is the moisturizer gonna lay your hair down? Because you're gonna have the do rag or su rag on overnight anyway. So if you're sleeping for eight hours, that's eight hours of compression. You ain't gotta worry about oh, is this moisturizer gonna lay my hair down? You ain't gotta worry about that. You already got your do rag on, so that's your compression right there. So you don't have to worry about that. So on to wave and scalp butter. I don't know I would, if I would say this is a pomade, but it's a good product. You can use this at night. It's basically a shine product. Um, I would say it's a light pomade. I don't know what to describe it as. I would say it's light, but use this when your hair is low or medium thick, or you can use it when it's real thick, it doesn't matter, but this is not your primary source of compression. Your primary source of compression is your do-rag or su-rag, and keeping it on for over an hour. If you want your hair to lay down, you got a lot of hair, you got eight weeks worth of hair on your head, don't keep your do-rag on for 20 minutes, that's not gonna lay your hair down. You need two hours or more if you got eight weeks of hair on your head. So. This is a good moisturizer, good shine product. It's nice. Get it off the same site. If you can't find the site, go to Google, type in cold label, Wave and Scout Butter. Now, pomade, another pomade I have by Wave Builder, Coco and Shea. Get this at Walmart, Beauty Supply. Not hard to find. Another good pomade. I mean, this is a new, I went and bought another one, but I used it before. It's a good product. It smells good. I believe it's natural. I don't know if it's all natural, but did that make sense? I don't know, but it's natural. I believe it's all natural. It, it holds your hair down good. I would say it's medium hold. You can use it when your hair is kind of thick. I don't know if you can use it with eight weeks of woofing, but it depends on your hair texture. This best works for, let me see, it, it works for any type of hair texture, coarse, straight hair, good hair, whatever you want to call it, but it's, it's a nice product. Now, another moisturizer, Curl Enhancer Smoothie. You, only, you can use this at any time, but I would say use it when your hair is thick because when your hair is thick, your hair is more prone to curling. And this product is a Curl Enhancing Smoothie, so it would be best, I would say, that's why they say use them when your hair is thick. Because your hair is prone to curl more when it's thick, opposed to when your hair is low. So, it's a good product. It really curls your hair up. So, but don't depend on this to give you waves. This is not a magic product. You're not going to, ooh, get waves. No, you got to brush. You got to put in that work.
This not gonna do it for you. The brush does. You got a brush. This is a good product. Moisture, body, and shine. Good product. Don't put it in your hair when it's wet because it tends to overcurl your hair and that can throw off your connections. I, I explained that in the previous video. You might want to catch up on that. One of my favorite moisturizers is As I Am Double Buttercream. Get this at Walmart, Target, Beauty Supply, I believe, Amazon. Love this product as well. Good smell. It's a nice moisturizer. You can put it you can put this in overnight during the day. You can put it in at any time. You can put any moisturizer in at any time of the day. At night, morning, whatever. It don't matter. Opposed to a pomade, you can't do that. I mean, you can do that if you want to, but this is my choice and, and this is what I suggest. So if you listen to what I'm saying, then follow what I'm saying. So it's a good good moisturizer. I, would, I don't know which one I prefer between these two. It depends on hair length, I guess. On the length of hair that I have, I believe. So, I can't pick one. Another shine product that's good. Sweet Jamila. This is my favorite smelling product. Um, smell good. It, it doesn't have any hold at all. So, use this only when your hair is low. But when you're seeking shine, you can use it at any time. Good product. Get search for it on Google. Right there. Another moisturizer I got is by Wave Builder. Wave Butter. Another good moisturizer. I believe it's all natural. Might not be. Smell good. It's kind of creamy, creamy based product. Get this at Walmart, Amazon, Beauty Supply. Simple. All you gotta do is. Um, wet your hair. Now this is not going to overcurl your hair, so I'm going to give you a method for it. You can wet your hair, hot towel, comb your hair so it can lift your hair up off your scalp. Throw this in there, brush it in, do right. You can do this morning, evening, at night. Same with, with this moisturizer. You can do the same method I just suggested for this one. Same method. Don't do it. Don't do the method with this though. Don't use water when you use a curl enhancer smoothie. Make sure your hair is dry when you're using this. I would I would describe curl enhancer smoothie as a a creamy pomade when you use it on dry hair. That's how I see it as because it, it really lays my hair down when I have my hair dry. It it lays my hair down perfect. So that's about it with products. I just got this new one, Frederick Benjamin Sleek Water Pomade. Um, I haven't tried it yet. I'm going to try it when my hair is low because I know gels, let me see, I think it's type of um, medium hole is gel, I believe, whatever you want to call it. This don't, gel type products don't work good when my hair is thick, It my connections be all off. It throws my hair all the way off. So I prefer to use a gel type product like this when my hair is medium length or low. To give it that, you know, that silky look without ruining connection. So that's basically it. If you ain't subscribe, subscribe. If you ain't like, like. If you ain't like the video, dislike. Do what you gotta do. Share it, comment, feedback, dislike, watch again, share it, watch again, dislike, do what you gotta do. Just make sure you listen and watch the previous videos on how to get ways and trust me, you'll understand. That's all there is to it, man. Brush your hair. Stay dedicated. Don't give up. Keep watching my videos. You'll get it. That's all there is to it. I'm out.